what is Polof? It's an all-inclusive website devoted to the publication, the marketing and promotion of my book, Portrait of a Legend and Other Folks. Um, the book, Portrait of a Legend and Other Folks, is a book of my work over the past 35 years as a photographer and it will include many unpublished photographs. Unpublished photographs of Bob Marley, Michael Jackson, Muhammad Ali, Diana Princess of Wales, George Bush Senior, um, Rajiv Gandhi, Margaret Thatcher, and other folks naturally. Jimmy Cliff, Peter Tosh. It is a book of all that I have photographed and for some reason I have photographed a lot of iconic individuals and non-iconic individuals. I would say the theme is Rasta. The theme is from a black perspective. The theme is images of people taken, not posed, but within aspect of their own environment. So the basic theme of the book is images of a photographer who is black from a black perspective, but not specifically inclusive of black people. Can you tell us why you've chosen to go down this route of using social media to publicize and market the book? One of the reasons why I chose to go along this route is because we are now in the age of the internet. We're in the intellect, technical, Twitter, Facebook age. It is relatively easy to communicate with people in Brazil, Japan, Thailand, the United States, New Zealand. And because my images will appeal to people in Japan, Brazil, Thailand, or Nepal, I have chosen to use the internet as a means of galvanizing and utilizing as many people to be involved in this project, either to invest in the project or to buy the book when it is finally published. The site Poloff.com is currently being constructed. It is hoped that by the end of August 2012, 2012, sorry, uh, the Poloff.com will be up and running. Um, I'm currently waiting on a few little things to be sorted out. But this will be it's just an introduction for people to come here to know that this book will shortly be in the making. So I'm really asking you to be calm, be patient, but it is coming. It will come. I have a Facebook page and uh, people can make friends with me, Lindsay Donnell, on my Facebook page. And when Pauloff.com is finally constructed, it will offer people as a crowdfunding site. Now, what must be understood or overstood is this. The primary function will be A, to generate investment to publish the book. The book will cost $150,000 to publish. The books in English will only be 
it will be 5,000, in fact, 5,000 copies. There will be limited copies only in English. But there is also plans to have a limited amount of copies done in German, French, Spanish, and Japanese, and ultimately a limited edition in Chinese. But for the moment, we are concentrated on doing a limited numbered edition in English. You mentioned the, the site will be a crowdfunding site. What incentives are there for people to get involved in actually being part of the crowdfunding? And part of being involved in a crowdfunding site is that you invest funds into something you believe is of value and will be worthwhile. There will be elements on this site for putting funds into it. The basic element would be a contribution. For instance, somebody would just want to give you 10, 20 pounds and say good luck. Somebody will probably want to give you 100 pounds, so in effect they will get a copy of the book. And if somebody gives you 500 pounds, they will get not only a copy of the book, but they will get a portion of the returns from that book, meaning they will be entitled to a share of the profit from this book. Also, everyone who even make a contribution, the minimum contribution on this crowdfunding site will be £10. And should you make a minimum contribution, you will be entitled to a print, a 5 by 7 Bob Marley print, which I will sign and send to you. So there will be incentives to make either a contribution or an investment into this book. What are some of the things that would definitely be of interest to people who've, who've yet to see the book yes. but would be pleasantly surprised by? Well, What are they buying into? Well, if you went on to... I have a website on titled Element um, where I have posted online a few images from my 10,000 odd negatives. Naturally, it is unwise to post every picture from the book, otherwise there will be no form of excitement, awe and wonder to see what else is in the book. But if you went on to my website, um, you will see some of the images that are likely to be in the book. There are images that I'm, I have had to embargo simply because of their exclusivity. My Michael Jacksons, my Muhammad Ali's, my Stevie Wonders, I've had to hold back many images that will be in the book but will not be seen on my website. So there will be 200 images in this book and the book will also have m many texts of Bob Marley interviews that have not been published. So in, in, in general, it's a book a lot of people are actually waiting for. And it is going to be a major book. For myself, it is a major project. But I believe, as a Jamaican photographer, it will be a major book that I hope will inspire other Jamaican photographers in the future. February 6, 2013 is now a tentative date for the release of Portrait of a Legend and Other Folks. And I'm hoping that many of you will either make a donation, a contribution, or an investment into this book once the website is up and running.